Good evening. It is a full moon tonight. Our blessed sovereign will be most pleased. The kingdom is very happy to hear the news that our blessed vampire sovereign has chosen a new consort. They have chosen you, my fellow human. Such a rare occasion. Normally the sovereign chooses one who is already a vampire. You must be very special. You will be turned on the same night as your wedding. many who are envious of you, and there are even more who pray for you. What kind of human could catch the eye of a vampire sovereign? What are you? You must be incredible, or are you as bloodthirsty as a vampire, despite your human appearance? <laughs> it is not my duty to question our sovereign, it is my duty merely to serve them. My task this evening is to prepare you for the ceremony. It will happen very soon. has decided to give you one more day in the sun. Tomorrow will be your last day as human. And when the moon rises, the ceremony will take place and you will be bitten upon the neck and slowly turned to a vampire. The honor is all yours. This shawl belongs to the sovereign. They want me to use it to clean your neck and shroud you with it. Such a precious gift. It is our sovereign's gift to you. The second gift is the gift of immortality. You will live forever unless the sovereign chooses to take a new consort and they will dismiss you permanently. You may have noticed how quiet it is. The solver. 
children is removing the curled consort. We are to be quiet out of respect and fear. You are not the consort yet. You must remain quiet. Our sovereign will not be gentle with you if you disobey their orders. Perhaps you can be a bit more mischievous once you are consort. But you still have a few hours before you are. Clean you. On your wedding day, our sovereign has pledged to make it rain blood once the ceremony is complete as a gift to the people. You will need to gather all that blood. The stables where the humans are kept will be emptied. The stables that you once occupied will be chosen. If you have any friends or family in there, you may wish to say your final goodbyes to them later. The makeup on your face. It is red, like the lower class who will be fed upon, but once I have cleaned it off, I will give you new markings, the ones that will tell everyone that you are consort. The rest of us have to earn other markings. My black markings mean that I am a higher ranked servant and I must complete the task that surround the ceremonies. I perform the rituals that let everyone see our sovereign's power. I praise them. I worship them for many years. And now I get to help the next consort be prepared. Do you know much about our Sovereign? They are powerful and frightening. 
frightening and wonderful and jealous. They demand all of the attention and they deserve it. Do not question them. Do not anger them. Just obey. That is enough cleaning. I can see your face. There are no more markings. The consort is like a gift to the sovereign, and they want you to be wrapped like a pretty present. I'm thinking of placing the ribbon around your neck. I think it will look lovely, tightly wrapped around your throat. Then the sovereign can slowly unwrap it right before they bite you. I think that will look acceptable.
not bad. You look like a gift waiting to be unwrapped. Sovereign does not care much for flowers, but is this tradition to carry a bouquet? You carry fake flowers. They last forever. They will symbolize what you will become. These flowers are very old. They belong to the former consort. Red roses seem to agree with you. Perhaps they will place red roses on your grave once the sovereign becomes bored of you. The previous consort lasted almost 200 years. It's a record. The previous consorts lasted about 15 or so years. Our sovereign has chosen you based almost entirely on your appearance. I wonder how well you will fare once the two of you 
have to communicate. I predict that you will last either a long, long time ruling alongside the Sovereign for centuries or the Sovereign will realize this was an error and eliminate you within a few hours That's part of the excitement, the not knowing what will happen next. We must continue our work. It is time to decorate your face with the markings to show everyone that you are consort Medicate your lips. This purple is so dark it almost looks black. But then the light hits it just right. You can see that brilliant royal purple.
You are truly worthy to be a consort now. Now for the difficult part, do not smudge your markings, spend the rest of your evening preparing and spend the last morning doing what you can with the last bit of your humanity. Say your goodbyes, enjoy the sunlight because after tomorrow night your life will only be night it has been an honor to prepare our blessed sovereigns Next consort. Thank you for this honor. Now you can rest or you can spend the rest of the night worrying about your future. Do as you please. I will remain here, preparing for the ceremony. 